तेरवान सरना हाँ मंत्रों ने मंत्र साता जी और हम बुरे दिन Mute Latin. Good afternoon, Bante. Teruan Saranay Bante. अरे क्या कथा भी ना नहीं इधर पासे में एक गंडों ना अन्ना हरी तेंगे है ना तेंगे है ना नहीं तो ही मैं हम तो नहीं अन्ना हरी ओके टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लिसन टू दिस यू सर्च लिसन टू द रिसाइटर है नको भगंधो पटिवात में ते न चंदनं सगर मलिकावा सतंच गंधो पटिवात में ते सब्बादिसा सब पुरी सो पावती चंदनं तगरंवापे उपलं अथवन्सिकी इति संगंध जाता Silagandho anotmutaro. Okay, friends. 
this is what we are going to study today. There are two stanzas today. One is this one. Let us focus our mind on the first one first. Okay. Uh, Napupagandu Patiwatameti. Listen to it once again. Napupagando Patiwatameti. Nachandanang Tagar Malika. Satancha Gando Pativata Mete Sabadisa Sapuri So Pavati. So we stop here. Okay. Now you can see the verses on the screen. Uh, okay. Okay. No, no, is no. Puppa gando. Puppa means flowers. Gando means fragrance. Pativatam against the wind. Vata means wind. Pativatam means against it. Eti goes. No, then na Chandanang. No, does Chandana or sandalwood. Tagara. Pinwheel. I don't know what that, what kind of flower is. That pinwheel is a tagara. Malika is white jasmine. Wa or Satanjagandu, but there is a word but, but is not, it is understood. Satanjagandu, the of the good, Satan means good saint, Satan Satan means saint, Pativatang against the wind. Sabba Disa, all directions. Sapriso, Sapriso is translated as the true person or person with integrity. Uh, then Pavayati permeates. Sabbadisa sapriso pavayati. Pavayati in all directions. So the meaning is very clear. The fragrance of flowers goes not against the wind. Nor the sandalwood of pinwheel or white jasmine. But the fragrance of the good goes against the wind. The true person's fragrance or the fragrance of the, uh, the person with integrity permeates all directions. Now this is a very meaningful stanza. Now let us go against, uh, let us go to the next one also because these two go together. This is uh, next one, you can listen to it. Sangandha <laughs> 
शील गांधो करो ओके चंदन सगर आपी चंदन चंदन मीन सैंडलवुड सगर स्प्रिंग व्हील उपल वोट लीली अथ दे वर्षिकी ट्रिपल जैसमीन ट्रिप जैसमीन जैसमीन आई डोंट नो व्हाट जैसमीन दैट जैसमीन इज देन ए तेसंग एमंग्स दिस गंध जाता है ना काइंस ऑफ फ्रेग्रेंस सील गंध वर्चुअल वर्चुअल स्प्रेग्रेंस अनुतरो इज अनसपास्ट Now, <clears throat> sandalwood, pinwheel, then water lily and stripped uh, jasmine. Among these kinds of fragrance, virtuous uh, fragrance is unsurpassed. Now, this is the meaning is very clear. Let us see the see what happened. What the story of this. uh and if this is very uh, uh meaningful uh so uh okay Venerable Ananda, one day was sitting in the sun, uh, and then he remembers that the Buddha's uh, uh, the popularity he was thinking of the buddha's popularity and he thought uh this sandalwood pin wheel uh and various type of fragrance uh, flowers are there uh sandal and uh, white jasmine and many other uh, flowers have their very sweet smell fragrance they are very good uh, now but they go only with the wind they don't go against the wind where the wind blows this fragrance goes there therefore when the ananda the wanted to see uh, what the buddha has to say about it so he went to the buddha paid respect and then uh, sat down and he expressed his understanding to the buddha when the buddha said i was meditating and i was alone then i saw uh a sandalwood pin wheel water lily and uh, tripped uh, what do you call uh flowers uh they have fragrance but they go only with the wind go with the wind but i like to know 
is there anything else, anything goes against, against the wind? Then the Buddha said, what is going with the wind? Uh, somebody's bad reputation or even the good reputation, especially somebody's bad reputation, goes with the wind. If somebody is uh, uh, breaking all the precepts, his reputation goes along with the wind, means people talk about his reputation of uh, murderer, uh, robber, and uh, one who is uh, uh, committing sexual misconduct, he is uh, uh, is drinking, he is uh, alcoholic, uh, and so forth. But if somebody is uh, is abstaining from all of them, those who commit all these unwholesome things, their uh, reputation goes only from mouth to mouth to down to the uh, against the wind, like against like like the wind, uh, um, for the gossip. It it is it stays in the gossip column. Doesn't go beyond that. But if somebody is uh, is is abstained from all these things, then uh, is uh, generous, is honest, uh, doesn't commit sensual misconduct. Uh, they. Uh, observe precepts and they listen to Dhamma, uh, live according to the Dhamma, and then that person's reputation goes in all directions, not only in one direction, but in all directions, because not only, you know, so, so called uh, criminals like people, but even good people talk about that. Then, therefore, it is just like going even against the wind. Uh, that is like uh, the flowers, fragrance, smell, uh, in the, it is not like the fragrance of flowers and so forth, but it is very uh, honest, noble. Uh, therefore, everybody uh, talk about the noble person. Uh, Therefore, Buddha said, uh, uh, one who observes precept, living according to Dhamma, and uh, uh, practicing meditation and so forth, to get rid of their greed, hatred, delusion, and they don't have anger, they don't... Uh, uh, they don't have jealousy, then people like to talk about them uh, very, very often. Uh, and that also doesn't go under the category of uh, uh, gossip. Uh, so, for example, in uh, there's a story we find in uh, commentaries. 
there was a village in Sri Lanka. There was a monk called Mahanaga. That Mahanaga was uh, so saintly, so noble, and his uh, reputation spread not only in Sri Lanka, but even went to India. Then there were some Brahmins living in Pataliputta, two Brahmins. Uh, they wanted to come and see this Mahanaga monk. Two of them came. Those days, of course, transportation was not uh, very comfortable right now. They might have taken very, uh, very, very, what you call traditionally made boats, no train and so forth. And on the way, one of them died. The other one came to Sri Lanka and went to Anuradhapura, where this monk lived. Then he went there and uh, after the meal, uh, they went to see this monk and paid respect to him and said, when was, sir, we came all the way from Jambudip, India, to see you because your reputation is very good. And we want to uh, become, I want to become a monk. Two of us came, one of, one died, and then I alone came. And uh, uh, it is great honor for me to receive ordination from you. So that venerable monk uh, ordained him and this man practiced Dhamma very, and very soon he also attained uh, enlightenment. And this kind of reputation is spread not only among human beings, even divine beings, this reputation is spread. In uh, Majjhimanika, there is a, discourse called Chula Gosinga Sutta, where uh, Venerable Anuruddha came with a but the three of them lived and they practiced metta. And they, the metta practice was so great that uh, everybody in that uh, area began to uh, practice metta and their reputation went up to Brahma realms, it said. So that is the story behind this. And therefore, this is a very encouraging uh, teaching that uh, uh, the reputation of the noble ones spread all directions, in ten directions. Uh, and therefore, we try to uh, follow their example and try to uh, practice Dhamma, meditation and so forth. Now, friends, I would like you to recite these stanzas. Uh, I don't think you all like my voice. Let me play this once again and then I like you to remember uh, and then you can uh, recite them. Then uh, we see. Okay, once again, I like to play this stanza. Napo Pagando Pateva Temete Nachandanam. Tagar Malika Satanja Gando Patevat Mete Sabadisa Sapuriso Pavati Chandanam Tagar Angwapi Upalang Atavasm 
सिकी ए संगंध जाता शील गंधो अनुतरो ओके नाउ लिसन टू व्हाट आई रिसाइट then i like you to recite after me that monk recite recitation is no break he just recited the whole thing i want to have line by line recitation so that you can listen and try to memorize try to memorize it and repeat after me na pup gandho repeat after me na pupagando patiwatang eti patiwatang eti you know patiwatang eti join together and say patiwat meti okay na chandanam na chandanam सागर मल्लिका सागर मल्लिका सतंज गंधो गंधो पटिवात एक्चुअली सम वर्जन इज वन वर्जन इज पवाति दिस वन इज पयाति perhaps uh, pavati may be correct uh pava payati is a mistake okay once again i recite line by line then you repeat after me nepu pragandho pativat meti गंधो पटिवात अगेन आई रीड लाइन बाय लाइन ओनली वंस देन यू रिसाइटेड व्हेन आई रिसाइट द होल थिंग यू रिसाइट द होल थिंग देन एट द एंड आई लाइक ऑल ऑफ यू टू रिसाइट इट individually okay na pup gandho pativat meti na chandanam tagar mallika va na pup gandho meti na chandanam tagar mallika va सतंज गंधो पटिवात मेति सब्बाद सा सब पुरुषो पवति सतंज गंधो पटिवात मेति सब्बाद सा पुरुषो पवति ओके लेट अस गो टू द नेक्स्ट वन चंदनं तगरं वापि चंदनं तगरं वापि उप 
फलंग अथवाध जाता शीलगंधो अनुत्तरो अगेन चंदन तगर वापी उपल अथवा संगंध जाता शीलगंधो अनुत्तरो ओके आई रीड तो फर्स्ट टू लाइंस एंड देन द सेकंड टू लाइंस चंदन तगर वापी उपल अथवा गंध जाता शीलगंधो अनुत्तरो ओके आई डिसाइड द होल सेंसा देन यू डिसाइड इट आफ्टर मी चंदन तगर वापी उपल अथवा गंध जाता शीलगंधो अनुत्तरो okay now is the real test <laughs> <laughs> each of you recite it separately i think on the top is my three okay my three yeah i'm going न पुपगंधोपतिवातमेति न चंदन तगर मल्लिका वतंच गंधोपतिवातमेति सब्बादिशा सपुरीशोपवाति चंदन तगर वापी उपल अथवा संगंध जाता शीलगंधो अनुतरो वेरी गुड नेक्स्ट इज निमि i cannot see the whole um um uh, okay. song now, okay now you can see <laughs> yes ma'am na pupagando pativatameti na chandanam takaramallikava satanchagando pativatameti sabbadisa su चंदन तगर वापी उपल अथवा 
ಚಂದಮಲ್ಲಿಕಾ ಸತಾಂಚ ಗಂಧೋ ಪಟಿವಾತ ಮೇತಿ ಸಬ್ಬ ದಿಸಾ ಸಬ್ ಪುರಿ ಸೋಪವಾತಿ ಸಬ್ಬ ದಿಸಾ ಓಕೆ ಓಕೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಚಂದ ನಮ್ ತಗರಂ ವಾಪಿ ಉಪಲಂ ಅಥವಾಸಿಕಿ ನಿಪುಣ ಸಪ್ಪುರಿ ಸೋಪವಾತಿ ಚಂದೋ next again is uh, what malit malit i don't hear you malit na pupa gando pativante di na kandanam taramali ಚಂದಿ ಉಪಾಲಿ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ಮಾಲಿತ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಈಸ್ ಅನಾಯ ನಪುಪ ಗಂಧೋ ಪಟವಿಪ್ಪಂ ಏತಿ ನಾಂಧಮ ಥಾಗ ಮಲಿಕವ ಸಾತಂಚ ಗಂಧೋ ಪಟವಿಪ್ಪ ಮೇತಿ ಸಬ್ಬ ದಿಸಾ ಸಪುರಿ ಸೋ ಪವಾತಿ ಓಕೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಚಂದನ ತಾಗರಂ ವಾಪಿ ಉತ್ತಲೇನ ಅತ ವಿಸಾಕಿ ಏತ ಗಂಧ ಜಾತರಾನ ಸಾಲ ಗಂಧೋ ಅನುತ್ತರ ಸೀಲ ಗಂಧೋ ಓಕೆ ಸೀಲ ಗಾಂಧು ಅನುತ್ತರು ಓಕೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಈಸ್ ತೇಸ ನಪುಪಾಂಧೋ ಪವಿತ್ರ ಏತಿ ನ ಚಂದನ ತಗರ ಮರಿಕವ ಸತಾಂಚ ಕಾಂಧೋ ಪತಿವತ್ತ ಮೇತಿ ಸಬ್ ದಿಸೋ ಸಬರಿಸೋ ಪವಯತಿ Okay, next one is... Uh, okay. Chantanam thagaram vapi Uppalam atavasikki Etasam gandh jathanam Seela gandho anuddharo 
good good then metuki uh, metuki okay your turn here this one okay mekiti kalu arachi okay metuki Hello? You are there? Okay. Then, uh, it me. Napupagando pativa me di na chantanam tagara alikava satan chaganto pativa very good. Then next one. Chandanam Dagaram Brahmi Upalam Atta Vasiki Etisam Ganta Jatanam Sila Gando and Very good. Then Netul. That will I show you your turn is this one. Netul. Okay, now you can see. Lapu Pagando Pativam Eti Nachandanam Tagara Malikava Satanan Chagando Pativam Eti Sapadis Sapuiso Pavati. Okay, good. Next one. Chandanam Dagaram Vapi Upalam Atavasiki Ete Sanganda Jatanam Silangado Silagando Anutta. Good. Then, uh, Maili Maili Napupagando Pativatameti Nachatanam Tagara Mali. Kava Satanchagando Pativatamati Sabadisa Sapi Sapuriso Pavayati. Okay, next one is then Chandanam Chandanam Tagaram Vapi Upalam Atavasiki Etas Etesam Ganda Jatanam Sil Silagando Anutra Hiro Yuku. Next one. Hiro Yuku. Ah, Napipagando Pativata Meti Nachandanam Tagara Mandikawa Satanchagando Pativata Meti Sapadisa Sapriso Pawati. Good. Next one. Chandanan Tagarama Tagaram Vapi Uparang Atavasiki Ete Sanganda Jatanam Siragando Anuttaro. Okay, thank you. That's the last one. Okay, you all did quite well today. And uh, now, central messages of both stanzas is that when you do bad things, nobody likes to talk about it. When you do good things, everybody likes to do like to talk about you, and people from various different long distant places come and see you and get your blessing, your advice and you try to follow they try to follow your example and so let us try to live exemplary life that is the message and now friends I want to uh, do uh, I want all of you to do some meditation. 
So let us uh, do that. Normally we take about half an hour, but uh, we spend much time in our uh, what do you call uh, discussion on the story on the, the this thing and therefore we don't have too much time for meditation however it is better to do some meditation at least for few minutes now <clears throat> let me read this for you you can listen to it. Can you see that? Can you see this? <coughs> no. Okay. Now you can see this? Yes, Bhante. Yes, Bhante. Okay. <coughs> I think by now you may remember all this, but still better to look at the screen. May all beings be happy and secure. May all beings have happy minds. Whatever living beings there may be, without exception, weak or strong, long, large, medium, short, subtle or gross, visible or invisible, living near or far, born or coming to birth, may all beings have happy minds. Let no one deceive another, nor despise anyone anywhere. Neither from anger nor ill will should anyone wish harm to another. As a mother who risks her own life to protect her only child, even so towards all living beings, one should cultivate a boundless heart. One should cultivate for all the world a heart of boundless living friendliness above, below, and all around, unobstructed, without hate, without hatred and resentment. Whether standing, walking, sitting, lying down, or whenever awake, one should develop this mindfulness. This is called divinely dwelling here not falling into erroneous views, but virtuous and endowed with vision, removing desire for sensual pleasures, one comes never again to birth in the womb. With this metta thought, let us continue our meditation. Uh, I also like to repeat what I said this morning, or if there are any new person to Remember this. Uh, when we sit to meditate, actually not only meditation, but any time, take deep breath and breathe out entire inhaled breath. It is said that we normally, if we are not mindful, we breathe out only 60% of our air in our lungs. But we want to remove that remaining 40% out of our lungs. So that lungs will be totally empty of air. And then we breathe in lung full of air, which is rich, which oxygen. And then again we do deep inhaling, deep exhaling, then we experience great deal of calm, peaceful state of mind, great calmness, peace we experience. And that makes us very uh, peaceful, alert, not sleepy. And also, 
on mundane level, this kind of slow breathing reduces our blood pressure. If you have blood pressure, you certainly might experiment it. Take a blood pressure measuring machine and check it. And you will see this. So breathe, breathe very slowly. Inhale and breathe out slowly until all air in your lungs is gone. Then then breathe in again. So this much is enough for you to practice and see the benefit by yourself for yourself. So I stop talking and let you practice.
by means of these meritorious deeds, may I never join with the foolish, may I join always with the wise until the time I attain Nibbana. May the suffering be free from suffering, may the fear struck be free from fear, may the grieving be free from grief, so too may all beings be. From the highest realm of existence to the lowest, May all beings arisen in these realms, with form and without form, with perception and without perception, be released from all suffering and attain to perfect peace. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So, friends, I want to share my metta once again, as I did this morning. May all beings who are in hospitals, <coughs> taken care of by various kind of compassionate doctors, nurses, and hospital staffs, may they recover very soon and return to their normal life, continue their Dhamma practice, meditation, and liberate themselves from samsaric suffering. May all the doctors who take their time, risk their life, sacrifice their comfort to take care of these people out of compassion, may they also find peace and happiness, find time to practice meditation. Right. Thank you, Bhante. May all those who have lost their loved ones and uh, grieving, May they be free from grief, as we mentioned earlier, and find peace and time to practice meditation and liberate themselves from samsaric suffering. May all those who are in troubled sports, in war zones and discrimination, poverty-stricken area, and going through all kinds of difficulties, may they find some moment of to practice Dhamma, meditate, understand the nature of life and find place to meditate and they to liberate from samsaric suffering. May all of you whose categories is not mentioned uh, all around in ten directions. May they all be well, happy, and peaceful and find time to practice Dhamma, meditate, and attain liberation. So, friends, I see you next week. Until then, you continue your Dhamma practice and benefit from the Dhamma. And you all attain liberation from samsaric suffering. Okay? Thank you, Bhante. Everyone, Saranai, Bhante. Everyone, Saranai. Everyone, Saranai. Everyone, Saranai. Okay.